In this video, I show you how to insert table slicers like this so you can easily filter data with the click of a button. Casper from Spreadsheeter here and the first step to inserting a slicer in your table is to actually make your data into a table. So select the cell, go to the insert tab, hit table. Before you hit okay, make sure to check if your table has headers. And if they do, check this checkbox. All right, the table is now inserted. So step two is to insert the slicer. So when you select the cell in the table, this table design tab appears. And in that you can click insert slicer. The slicer is basically a fancy way of filtering data. So you want to select here what data you need to filter on. In this case, I want to filter on the sales rep because I need to see how many orders are sold from Nate or Abigail. And I can do that if I check this sales rep box. Okay, pretty cool. Step number three is to change the appearance of your slices and table if you want to. This is optional, but you can modify this as much as you want up here in the slicer tab. There are actually a lot of options here. So you can choose from darker themes if you want that, change the color theme entirely, and even the size and alignment of everything. Also, you can go to the slicer settings to change the name of it, hide the name entirely, and select how the items are sorted and filtered here in the slicer. All right, so step number four is just to enjoy your new slicer. Let's change the color here to this instead. Now, when you click a button here in the slicer, the column that you selected while inserting the slicer is filtered. So if I click on Lindsay here, it's only the order sold from Lindsay that appears in the data set. Another thing you can do is you can multi-select by holding down control or shift, and then you can select multiple items here in the slicer. Pretty cool, huh? If you want to learn more Excel, please check out my free online Excel training at spreadsheeto.com slash YouTube. But if you want to stay here on YouTube, please check out this video right here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.